Hey, what's up? This is Ray Carlisle with Teenage Bottle Rocket. I'm kicking it with my friends, Moth the Flame. This is Rudy. We're at the Mohawk here in Austin, Texas right now. We are outside the green room upstairs. I just stepped in gum, which is uh, quite typical on tour for me. We are on tour with Face to Face right now. It's an honor to be on tour with this band. Face to Face totally rules. We're okay. We lucked out and got on this super awesome tour, and we feel lucky to get to do it. Just kidding, we're pretty good, I think. I don't even know anymore. The face to face guys are super nice, and the Blacklist Royal guys are really good dudes and really cool, and yeah, it's, it's been good so far. We broke down before the first show, which sucked. We set it off towards Reno, Nevada from Colorado. I swung by Wyoming and picked the guys up. And the van made it about halfway. It, it was the engine kind of, I don't know. There was a lot of oil. I don't know anything about cars. But luckily, we flew our tour manager to Reno. My name is Corey Nesbitt. I am their tour manager. Luckily, I was in Reno with a time to spare, and I went, I took a cab to some Salvation Army lot and bought a van. We were in, like, nowhere Nevada, and, uh... Ray called up Fat, and they sent Corey money. Corey bought a van and came and rescued us. I'm in the nun house. I'm in the nun house. I'm in the nun house, and then I gotta let me out of here. I'm in the nut house. I'm in the nut house, baby. I'm in the nut house, and then I gotta let me out of here. Let's go. Not that many people know this, but Brandon and I are drummer, my twin brother. He and I were born in Katy, Texas, so we're Texans. Ray and I were born there on I-10 in the Memorial City Hospital. My old man lives in Arlington, Texas, and I wish I lived there as well. Because one, my dad totally fucking rules and I love him. Two, Texas Rangers totally fucking rule and I love them. The weather is awesome down here. The food is awesome down here. Our tour manager is Corey, and he's been with the band for like over seven years now. Corey does everything, short of wiping my ass for me, which, you know, might eventually happen. I uh, drive most of the driving. I. Uh deal with the promoters and the venues and on this tour face to face is tour manager kind of deal with all that stuff so they don't have to answer any questions basically i keep ray from answering any questions and then he's happy Corey does everything and clint is there uh he's kind of the whipping boy of the band my name's clint and i just take a lot of shit clint forgot about him he's easy to forget about you know, he's just about as creepy as you can get. I've picked up a few chicks as the merch guy. Just kidding. He uh, generally scares the hell out of everybody. Tell us about your girlfriend. What's her name? <laughs> I don't have a girlfriend, Ray Carlisle. Uh, he's been texting this girl named Marky nonstop. I think it's a thousand times a day. Don't you want to say something to her? Why did you have to do that? <laughs> What a dick. Hi, Markle. Blood on the register, the grill and on the floor. Blood on the fryer and the walk-in cooler door. Blood on the register, the grill and on the floor. Blood on the fryer and the walk-in cooler door. Blood on the register, the grill and on the floor. On tour one time I got beat up by a girl that had no legs and one arm. 
and on the one arm she only had like three or two fingers. Anyway, so other people had to help tape me up to this coat rack and she was like in her little wheelchair with her little like motor sort of scooting back and forth to like grab implements off the table and scoop back over to like hit me with them or burn me with them. Um, that was a pretty good one. Let's go with that. <laughs>